Hey, this is Mass X with a new Bleach Immortal Soul video, and I've got another two minute video review for you. And today's focus is on Maiori, Fully Awakened, one of my favorite characters out of the anime. But is he that good when he's fully awakened? Let's take a look what he does fully awakened. Legendary character recovers 500 rage after activating mad scientist okay rage attacks inflict two stacks of poison on targets for two rounds that's what's the nice thing that they gave him which is very cool and the rage recovery does help after activating mad scientist but let's look at his skill set to see how well it works with it well mad scientist is his passive skill as you're aware it makes him immune to poison when his hp equals zero he becomes immune to all remaining damage and recovers hp triggers once per battle the heals 33.75 percent fully leveled which is nice keeps him alive but he still is not very tanky just so you're aware his rage skill deals damage to all enemies which is always cool additionally poisons the targets of course last two rounds and has a 28 percent chance to paralyze that's where he's lacking to me i really wish when they did him fully awakened, they would have increased his paralyzation chances. That would have been key and I think would have made him much better. His mastery skill deals damage to a single enemy. There's a 30% chance to paralyze the target for one round. Again, if we would have got that paralyzation up, I think he would have been a top tier awakened character. But because of that, I really don't think he is. And it hurts me to say this, but he's the mid tier when it comes to awakened characters. He's not bad, but he's not spectacular. He's no Tosin, he's no Unahana, but he is serviceable. And if you need a character to tank on that front line, and if you get lucky and you hit some of those paralyzations, then hey, he's well worth it. With that, please like and subscribe as always. It helps so much. Take care.